It's only game. Why you have to be mad? What is up, heroes of Dominion? My name is Charlie. This is Hero War Central, and this is going to be the first of seven episodes in the Daily Path of Light event videos. If you're curious about what I'm referring to, please check out the blog post linked in the description box down below. It's the very first post down below. You might want to give that a read if you are a Facebook or web player. Just go check it out. Just go check it out. So every day, uh, I haven't done this in past events, but I thought that I might uh, with this one. Every day, we're going to discuss the event a little bit as we learn more and more about about the uh, the day to day that we're going to be going through the uh, individual quests that we're going to have to do and you know any other thing that might come up with the daily event itself this is not meant to be a complete guide to the path of the light probably do one of those separately but uh, today's event video is going to be about fighting this boss the introductory story and a little bit more on the on the backside. So uh, the five tasks, five. This one right here was open five summoning Titan summoning spheres. This one right here is upgrade any hero's skin one time. We'll go ahead and upgrade Celeste. This one right here is spend five hundred tower coins. I don't have any tower coins on this account, so I can't really do that. Uh, this one is start or join one adventure. I'm not team level 40, so I can't do that either, unfortunately. And then finally, this one right here is upgrade gift of the helmets on one hero. We can definitely do that but not by much. Uh, every day we'll go through these tasks as well as uh, completing the ones that we can. So on to the story, on to the story. We have Tristan, the new hero. The road was long and hard, but I'm prepared to endure any hardships. After all these weeks, I stand at the last, I stand at last before the Temple of Celestial Wisdom. So the Temple of Celestial Wisdom is where the Valkyries reside. And uh, this is where they give us the Valkyries favor. The dwelling halls of the Valkyries who bestow their blessing on the courageous and the warriors of the lights as well as demon hunters such as myself. It's high time I proved my efforts deserve the blessing. Are my eyes deceiving me? A horde of enraged monsters is the last thing I expected to see at the gates of the sacred temple. And then we uh, we got to fight this guy. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to defeat this on this account, but we're just going to we're going to do our best. We don't have any pets. Um, this is just some low level enemies. And as far as I know, the the team level uh, your team level is going to determine the enemy's power level. So in future videos, in future daily videos, I'll, I'll use my actual main account. Uh, I already did all that last night, so I couldn't uh, couldn't use it for this video. Thank you, Traveler. The lesser minions of the dark have been skulking around the outskirts of the temple lately. Something must be attracting them. O oh, Celestial Maiden, I swore to keep destroying demons until the day I die. Might I receive the Valkyrie's blessing? It would give me the strength to proceed with my sacred mission. What a fine oath, Hero. I'll let you into the temple and grant you the blessing if you do me a favor. The locals from a nearby village are complaining about their elder. He's either blind with love or completely mad. Find out what happened to him and you shall receive what you yearn for. So one of Tristan's neighbors is going crazy, going blind with anger or, or with love or, or something. We'll find out more in the story tomorrow or throughout the rest of the week. But my reward is 1,500 of these pure coins. And the first question that I want to answer with this video series, how best to spend these pure coins should you buy tristan should you buy tristan's solar skin should you buy the celestial gift boxes should you buy items well i am here to tell you that you should not spend eight thousand pure coins on tristan absolutely do not do that unless you're trying to build tristan because you just love this guy it is much more valuable to spend these eight thousand coins on items much more valuable just taking a quick look at the alchemist set and the lycanthropes fangs plus the lion's helmet this is eight thousand right five thousand plus three thousand is eight thousand that's that's math that even i can handle these two items will take you weeks of item farming to get weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks of item farming to get or you could spend eight thousand on a hero that you may or may not ever use now if you do want tristan should you spend the eight thousand on this no again you should not use this at all do not use this at all so i made 1500 pure coins I can buy two celestial gift boxes and we're going to do that now what happens when you summon tristan is that his soul stones pop up in the gift box but somebody last night suggested that i check to see if his gift boxes pop up before you summon him so we're gonna we're gonna open these two and lo and behold you can get tristan soul stones out of the celestial box without actually spending the eight thousand on him so the uh, two that i had turned into two plus a tristan soul stone and you're gonna see that these are just like the nesting dolls they keep opening into each other i got 200 free tower coins plus two more <laughs> Just for purchasing the two chests, I'm getting loot, I'm getting soul stones, I'm getting more celestial gift boxes. It just, just keeps going. I just bought two, and there we go. So I got four, and that's the last of it. So let's go take a look at how many soul stones I got for Tristan. 
just for buying those two boxes. Here we go. So I've got 15 out of 30 for buying these two boxes. So just a recap for this daily event video. New players, mid-level, lower-level players, you should buy the Celestial gift boxes. The rewards I'll put on screen now. Load Runner shared the rewards with us. I don't have the percentage chance of what comes in these boxes, but I do have an idea of what uh, what all can come in these boxes. And like I said, it'll be on screen now. This is going to be the best value for you. And if you are a uh, mid to late game player, if you've been around for a while, then these items are going to be a better value for you. Buying Tristan and potentially buying the solar skin for Tristan seems like not the best value. Now, things could change. We could discover some kind of use case for Tristan that ends up being completely amazing. But as it sits right now, Tristan is underwhelming on Facebook and web. We're going to discuss more of that in today's live stream. Again, I live stream Monday through Friday, and today's live stream is at 12 p.m. Central Time, 5 p.m. UTC. We're going to discuss this more in depth. We're going to try to find some home for Tristan, some team fit for Tristan later today. We're also going to talk about the Facebook bug fixes that came through. Those are published to the official Facebook page earlier this morning. Don't forget to check out the blog post. Listen in the description box down below. I love you all. Good luck in Dominion.